What's up guys, Psychic C here and in this video we'll be unlocking version 2 of all races in King Legacy. Like, subscribe and turn on post notifications and let's get right into it guys. Alright, so we're going to start with the Mink race bro as you can see the ears right there. And we're going to get Mink V2 of course and you're going to need like a lot of carrots guys. Like a lot of carrots around 8,500 just to be safe. But it definitely has to be over 8,000. And let's just go, guys. Follow me to Fior Island real quick. And let's go. All right, guys, so we are here at Fear Island and we are going to have to go to a lot of destinations, guys. So follow me down here real quick, guys, to the first NPC. And we're going to speak to this rabbit, right? She's going to ask us for 500k and eight carrots. There we go. That was the first NPC. Now we're going to go back to the front of the island. And we're gonna go in this house right here and we're gonna talk to this guy there's also a number right here above their script or the yeah, their cloud their chat cloud right here so you'll know that you're doing this in order he's gonna ask for 16 carats so each time they double the amount you mean increase perception increase to level one okay and then the third one is hey what's going on here bro all right so the third one is all the way up by the mansion bro so let's go up here and go around the left of the mansion and talk to this guy right here no lagging no lagging all right so the third yes yeah, so i doubled again 32 carats and now guys we are going to go over to Tundra Island. Tell me, well, that's, a, yeah, Tundra Island right there. Desert Island, guys. I thought it was Tuna Island for a second, my bad, but let's go, guys. Alright guys, so we're here at Loaf Island, take a ride with me real quick guys, and let's go behind this boss over here, and we have, which number is this, the 6th NPC, nice, and let's head over to the next island, alright, so we're going to Skull Island now guys, where we have Kaido, alright, so that's close by actually right over here.
all right so now that we are at the actual skull just go to this guy by this little house right here he's npc number seven five hundred and twelve that's a lot all right so let's go on to the next by soldier hq that should also be close by let me turn on my graphics real quick Hokkaido is here that's nice all right so over to our left All right, guys, so we are at the HQ, and if you're wondering, I'm to the left of the island. We're um, Fujitora is our Gravito, and we're gonna go to NPC number eight. So that's the left of the island, guys. Yeah, right behind the boss. All right, so the next island we're going to is Pirate Skull Island. That's Blackbeard Island, guys. So let's go real quick. All right, so that's over to our right or the right of the island. Let's go. All right, guys, so know that we're at the Blackbeard Island. You want to go to the center. Well, it's actually more to the front, but this building right here, guys, this building right here. NPC number nine, nice, 2,048 carats, that's a lot, bro, for real. All right, so we're gonna go over to the Japan island now, and let's go back there, guys. These islands are actually in order. Uh, the, the next island is usually close by, but let's go, guys. All right, guys, so we are here at the prison and we need to go to the left of the prison and enter. And right here, we'll see the 10th NPC to give carrots to. That's 4,096 right there. So that's really a lot, bro. All right, so your minx race perception has increased to level five. That's nice. Now we're gonna just head back to fewer real quick and just follow me guys this is, we're getting like very close right here bro all right guys so we're here at fear island and let's head to the last npc real quick bro just follow me All right, guys, so we're gonna enter this little room right here. And this guy, he's gonna give you mighty power. Running speed faster, much more further than further off dashing and increasing a little bit damage of electro. right there guys we just got the main v2 race bro i don't think was this i don't think this this tail was here before guys i'm trying to see if the dash is faster guys but i think so i think the running should be a bit faster i'm bro i can't barely tell the difference right now i'm not gonna lie I think the dash is a bit faster guys but that's how you get mink v2 let's move on to fishman real quick guys all right guys i'm here with fishman race and let's go for that v2 guys so first up guys you're gonna need 100 fresh fish right here then you're gonna need three seekings of blood and one seekings fin and then you're gonna need to go to the shredding danger island half hot half cold well let's go over there real quick and just talk to that npc
all right guys so once you're at half, half hot half cold let's go to this npc at the center called atta and he, what is it he or she they'll give you a quest you're gonna need to pay two million you're gonna give all the ingredients i mentioned earlier and you're gonna need to kill a c beast with a specific sword called demon trident this red sword right here from neptune in first c and you're gonna i mean you get the sword from the boss neptune in first c you need to use this sword and defeat five sea kings to reach to let your fishman race reach level five and that's what we're gonna do so let's go guys all right guys we just made it to fishman level five and with that guys let's go back and speak with atta bro all right so let's see what he has to say now all right so i'm here with atta guys for some reason my game isn't loading in fully but all right so you were different the last time you saw it so i'm gonna strain more all right there loaded in accept try see oh try seek someone who might strengthen you more all right guys so now we're gonna go to fear and find that npc that he's talking about which i think is perry so let's just go to fear real quick guys all right guys so we are here at fear at the mansion oh, quite a lag hey my game keeps loading in very slowly i don't know why but this is perry all right so this is what he looks like Fisherman right here. I've sensed that you knew Ada and completely understand. Completely understand, blah, blah, blah. And there. We evolved our race, guys. We got a new title too. Now we have fins not only on our back, but on our the back of our feet as well. On our feet. On the back of our feet as well. And I think this means that we can... Whoa, why is it dash? I don't know if it's me or the dash feels fast, bro. But this is how you get Fishman V2, guys. You should be able to take less damage or something like that. Swim faster. Two. And this is Fishman V2. Actually, I meant take no damage at all. I forgot this is V2, not V1. But take no damage at all. And swim faster, guys. So this is cool. This is really cool, bro. Alright, so this is how you get Fishman V2 and on to the next race, guys. Alright, guys, so we're here with Sky Pian Race or Angel Race. And we're gonna get V2, guys. So, real quick, you need Pole, which you get from the first C Sky Boss. I think it's the Lightning Boss. And then you're gonna need also 350 Angelic Feathers and three lost rubies now after having all of that guys you want to be in second c and just follow me to this npc real quick all right guys so right beside the uh, japan mansion I, I just, i'm just gonna call it that you're gonna come to this npc called sonia and you're gonna talk to her and she's gonna give you a quest well, you're gonna give her the angel feathers, the lost ruby, and two hundred thousand. And she's gonna give you a quest to level up your race. All right, so right here, this quest is saying we need to go to first C, go to Sky Pia, and defeat the Sky Pia mobs until we get level 5 mastery on angel race guys so let's head to first here real quick let's go all right guys so we're here in first scene let's head over to sky island real quick okay so we're gonna defeat these mobs with pole this is why you need a pole so we're gonna defeat these mobs with pole until our sky i mean yeah our sky race is at level five all right so let's go
all right guys so all you have to do is just defeat all the sky npcs on this island five times and you'll get your angel race to level five and let's just head back to second c to sonia real quick and finish up this quest bro all right so talk to Millen at fear all right so we're going all the way to fear so just follow me to fear real quick guys all right guys so we made it to fear and we're just gonna head to the mansion real quick and we're gonna go right on the roof and we're gonna go into the room right here and here we are with the melon all right so we just talk to her and she'll improve your abilities right there we have skype here i mean angel v2 yo i'm so used to other one piece games but the get point the get point is like way faster damn bro and we have 17 instead of what 15 or 40 and somewhere there but like the, the gepo is fast bro and that's how you get angel v2 let's move on to the next race guys all right guys so we're here with the human race and let's get v2 real quick so just follow me from the middle of the town to this guy right here adam and he asks for a phoenix tier all right, so he, well, he's asked for 1,000 logs, $2 million, and a Phoenix tier. All right, guys, so you're going to talk to him one more time. He's going to tell you to bring the Phoenix tier to a night at Fior. All right, be safe. You're going to bring it to Fior to Lucas, guys. So let's go. Alright guys, so we have fewer and we're gonna go over to the mansion, bruh. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Alright, so Lucas is right here. He's gonna tell you to call it the ghost ship's treasure until you think until you have reached level five, bro. So you're gonna have to defeat ghost ship at least five times call it the treasures and level up the race and then come back and talk to him again guys so let's go all right guys so we're back after getting our human race to level five defeating ghost ship we are with lucas again let's talk to him again all right so whoa look like you got yourself whatever whatever and here we go new title and our race has evolved so our can increases by one the so the teleportation skill increases by 50 percent and every human fighting style like black leg and dragon claw deals more damage bro all right so that is how you get fishman i mean human v2 my bad guys human v2 my bad okay i don't think can i see the numbers bro dodge all right it won't show it won't show right here until i have dodge something or, or maybe my game is broken or something but this is how you get the human race v2 guys let's get into the next one all right guys so we're human again guys and we're gonna get seeking race so we are at 30c currently and we're gonna go over to the shallow island so let's go real quick guys all right guys so we're here and you're just gonna follow me to the back of this island to this puzzle and we're gonna speak to this npc which is gonna allow us to do the puzzle also guys you're gonna need 100 c artifacts for version one but well, let's go guys all right so this guy right here neptunian we talk next sure all right so 100 c artifacts only for the first payment so you won't pay again and well with v1 you won't pay again and let's talk to you one more time. Would you like to test again? We, 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 we already started. So we have five minutes to complete this puzzle right here. So let's get to it, guys. All 
all right guys so i did this was about three times but it was just too much so i had someone help me which i right, thanks to that guy bro because this was taking some time but we unlocked a new title let's talk to this guy again all right so yeah all right so there we have version one right here with the scale on my head and my ears and let's just well first before we actually get before we actually get v2 i need to go back like bro all right guys so this is version one of the seeking race and with this version you take a small amount of damage with fruit in water not sure about the regenerative skill in water though but their swimming speed is probably increased than the average human or the average race i'm assuming and let's go ahead and just get version 2 real quick guys all right guys so let's talk to this guy again right here and for v2 we need 50 sea artifacts 25 corals 10 shark fins five pearls and one aqua gem guys all right guys new title and we have gotten seeking race v2 bro finally seeking race v2 bro all right so what this version does guys is that once you're equipped with fruit you no longer take damage in the water your swimming speed is increased and you regenerate hp in water also guys and i hope this video helped y'all guys don't forget to like subscribe turn on post notifications all links will be in the video description below my discord group i'm starting a king legacy farm group guys my instagram and tiktok page go follow me there and the game link also you can play you can find a game to play and without further notice guys have a good one. Psychics out. Peace.